Hi, I'm Gary Jones. I'm the house organist here at the Alabama Theater in Birmingham, Alabama, and I'm seated at the console of our mighty Wurlitzer Theater pipe organ, affectionately known as Big Bertha. Now, Big Bertha was built in 1927 and shipped from the Wurlitzer factory in North Tonawanda, New York on November 11, 1927 and brought down and installed and opened and played on day one here at the Alabama Theater. Now, this console is a one-of-a-kind, four manual, four keyboard with a pedal board. Uh, there are two sets of chambers on either side of the auditorium. There's a solo side behind us over here behind the curtain and a string and a main chamber behind us here over my right shoulder. Wurlitzer actually never called this an organ. It was referred to as a unit orchestra and it's designed to mimic a 41-piece orchestra. The organ was designed originally to accompany silent films. In 1927, all films were silent. And at the end of 1927, an amazing thing happened, and that is Al Jolson uttered those famous words, Wait a minute, wait a minute, you ain't heard nothing yet. And thus the introduction of talkies came about, and the organ at that point was relegated for solo work. In the late 60s, uh, a group of volunteers uh, came into being, formed the chapter called the Alabama Chapter of the American Theater Organ Society and began regularly maintaining the organ here. And their job and their function each weekend since then has been to spend countless hours maintaining all of the components of the Mighty Wurlitzer Theater pipe organ. Um, in the late 80s, the current owners of the Alabama had filed for bankruptcy and the Theater Organ Society tried to purchase the organ as part of the liquidation. But the bankruptcy attorneys, being very savvy, realized that the only valuable asset of the whole entire facility was the organ. So they told the Alabama chapter of the American Theater Organ Society that in order to purchase the organ, they would have to purchase the building. So the Alabama Theater Organ Society formed another Another nonprofit, another 501c3 called Birmingham Landmarks, to own, purchase, operate, maintain, and restore the Alabama Theater. As the heart and the musical soul of the Alabama Theater, Big Bertha is enjoyed regularly by patrons of all ages. And as the single most noticeable fixture within the theater, she is many times the whole reason folks come down to enjoy the Alabama Theater and a film or a concert here at the Alabama Theater. We certainly hope that you'll be able to enjoy her as well.